Preventative maintenance in OMS helps you plan out your work on any given vehicle by automatically scheduling tasks when the triggers in the system fire based on the plan that you've created for them. Um, in most cases, those, those tasks are actually sort of pseudo tasks that sit in the system and are giving you the ability to see when the next time that this, this a particular event should occur and automatically transforms them into real tasks when the actual dates or times or whatever have been uh, tripped in the software. Uh, in those cases, we're still allowing you to see the projected tasks and when those things should occur, but it's possible that you could have one sitting in the system um, that isn't th at the exact same time that a breakdown might occur, for instance. So if you brought a vehicle in for a breakdown and you go to fix it, you don't want to take that vehicle back off the lift and send it back out, only to notice that three days from now, you've got another task that was supposed to be fired off in the system. So in order to help accomplish that, we've provided these projected tasks and the ability to convert those tasks immediately into the software. So I'm going to switch over now, and you'll see that I'm on a dump truck here, and I've got uh, several tasks, one that I'm planning to do here, and then a couple of projected tasks with varying dates. Um, you'll notice that the, the brake replacement that I'm about to perform is due today, and uh, just a couple of days away, I have another projected task that is scheduled to be done, in this case, uh, PMA, or Preventative Maintenance A. So what I'm going to show you now is if I come down here and select the planned task that I'm going to do, uh, I'm going to switch over to the tasks area, which, I'm actually, which is where I'm actually going to perform that work. You'll notice that this little blue bar popped up on the bottom here. That's my indicator to know that, hey, there's something else that I should be looking for for this piece of equipment so that when I bring it in, again, I don't get it up on the lift and have to take it back down. So I'm going to click on the bar. It brings up a list of all of the tasks that are there, and I can say, hey, I've got another task here that's just three days away, and I can make the decision right then and there, do I want to actually do this work now? Do I have the resources and materials and things like that on hand, or should I send it back out? If it was just the two for six, six for the PMC and the PMB, which are months away, I might just as well say, okay, I've taken note of it, but I'm not going to do anything now. But this one that three days, this three days away, seems like I should just take care of it. So I'm going to come over here to the uh, task line, and you notice I've got a little sort of create task icon here. I'm going to click on that. This will bring up the traditional task icon, or the traditional task uh, wizard, excuse me, and I'll be able to convert it right then and there in a couple of easy clicks. So I'm going to say today, today, uh, next. I could assign somebody if I wanted to. I'm going to go ahead and say finish and save. Now I have both tasks, the one that I was already planning to do for the brake replacement, as well as the new one that I just converted into a task for PMA, and I'm going to get them both accomplished right now. So that's the, uh, that's the functionality in OMS that will allow you to uh, automatically generate tasks from projections so that you can keep things moving in a nice, even fashion without having scheduling conflicts and so forth and so on.